Thank you, Tori. Republicans just pushed a $1.5 trillion tax overhaul through the House of Representatives today. And this makes good on a promise to reform the country's tax code. The House bill collapses today's seven personal income tax rates into four, 12, 25, 35, and 39.6 percent. Corporate taxes would be slashed from 35 percent to 20 percent. It ends the fines on Obamacare. Colorado Congressman Mike Kaufman voted for it. Congresswoman Diana DeGette voted against it. It's a giveaway for the ultra-rich and corporations, and millions of middle-class families are going to actually pay higher taxes. So I, I think it's just a bad deal for Americans. I think the fact that, that it does a lot to move this economy forward, that's going to help with wages, that, that's going to help with job creation, I think is extraordinary. When I think about the criticisms of it, oh, that it's a tax cut for the rich, well, <laughs> let me tell you, I got some calls from rich people that aren't happy because they're, the top rate stays the same uh, at 39.6. Projected federal deficits would grow by $1.5 trillion over the coming decade, but Kaufman says the bill will spur economic growth that will more than offset that. The Senate is working on its own tax plan.